Probably. Ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How come nobody's covering this? Game to win. Game hard. What's going on, y'all? Nick here. Coming to you with another video. Check this one out, y'all. I've never seen anything so disturbing in my life. Um, apparently, there's these colored folks in the car. They seem to have robbed the vehicle. And you're going to see within the video that they proceed to not only hit one car with this stolen vehicle, but then they actually have the nerve to actually run over a retired sheriff. Um, it's extremely sad because, again, this is the kind of talk that is, this is the kind of stuff that it makes it very hard for you as a melanated person to come to the defense of other melanated people. Because what you start to see is that the more you start to actually open up your eyes and the more you start to look at reality, you start to realize that there is something very wrong with the consciousness of melanated people, whether they were Hispanic, black, whatever the case may be. But there's something extremely wrong because they seem to engage in a lot of ignorant activity. And it just makes black people as a whole look bad. But, you know, check this video out for yourselves, y'all. So there, there it goes. You know, I wanted to cover this because I, for some reason, this seems like it's being swept under the rug. And, you know, it's so sad to me because I have saw some of the comments where I've seen this on TikTok where people believe that this somehow is related to, you know, perhaps Jordan um, Neely, where he seemed like he was attacked by a retired Marine Um and perhaps that this is somehow some type of retaliation. I don't believe any of, of that. I just think that these were some ignorant black or Hispanic folk. That's what it seemed like to me. Um, they got the mask on. And, you know, again, it's just it just seems like very ignorant activity. That's the best way I could really describe it. There is no other words to describe this, y'all. Um, I really just want to hear from you guys. You know, have you ever seen anything of this sort? Because, again, I don't know what it is about the youth, especially our youth. Why do they have to continually engage in such ignorant activity? It's beyond me. And, again, I just think that every time we take steps to move forward, when you see things like that, it just puts the whole community back several steps. You get what I'm saying? Because now the constant outlook on people with our color is always like, oh, they no good. They're a bunch of thugs. They're a bunch of gangsters. And you name it, all the crap under the sun, right? But they are not indicative of all black people, all right? So let's just understand that, right? I know I have an intelligent audience here. But yet here and still, like, how, why would you rob a car, purposely hit another man's car, and then run over somebody? Like, where in the most high's green earth does that make any type of sense? Please explain that to us. Please. And apparently, the sheriff, you know, supposedly he passed away as a result of all of this. Um, it's not 100% confirmed, but from what I've seen in the comments and from, you know, other media outlets that I'm reading, it seemed like he passed away. To think someone's life was taken away due to this just idiotic activity it's beyond me but anyway i really want to hear from you guys in the comment section down below with that being said nick over and out the message sent jesus is king y'all